Hi everyone, welcome to the Essence of Life. Thank you for tuning in. This is a Sagittarius reading for all signs, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs, also cross watchers as well. Thank you all for watching. So we can jump into this reading. We've got messages here from the Romance Angels to outline today's reading. We've got heart to heart conversations, honestly discuss your feelings with each other. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. We've got let your friends help you. Ask for, ask for and accept support from others. And engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. Okay, let's get the tarot. Tap into the energies surrounding your situation this week. Do you remember energies can be vice versa or interchangeable. There's no gender in tarot, it's all just energies. So please take the messages as it resonates for you and your situation. So we've got a three card spread giving us the three of swords. We've got eight of pentacles and four of pentacles. So we'll clarify. Queen of cups in reverse, knight of cups and six of pentacles. Further clarified, Queen of Swords, Ace of Pentacles in reverse, Ten of Swords. Oh, wow. Okay, so let's see what's going on. So I can see here, it looks like there's a transition here. Looks like there's a transition. So uh, this card, this reading, sorry, is picking up the uh, the energy of someone coming towards you. Knight of Cups. Knight of Cups. We've got Queen of Cups. This person may have water in their chart. Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces. It looks like they're coming towards you. Yeah, this is someone that's coming towards you here to work on this, uh, building a connection with you, building a relationship with you. Yeah, four pentacles in reverse. This is someone that is uh, opening up. This is someone that was holding back from you. Four of pentacles in reverse. This is, yeah, they're not holding back no more. Yeah, I can see this is someone coming towards you. But the thing is, this is someone leaving. They are leaving somebody else. Hey, this is what I can see. There's a transition going on. This person is tra in transition. They're leaving in a, a situation that they're attached to outside of you. Because uh, I can see there's a, there's a third party, third party interference here. Three of Swords. It's difficult. It's difficult times right about now. Like on an emotional level, it is really difficult times for this person here, for someone here. With this three of swords, ten of swords. It's hard times. It's really painful times right about now. It's a painful transition. But it looks like it's necessary though. It's necessary, yeah. There's two queens here. Yeah, this is someone leaving someone to come and uh, work things out with you. Yeah, Six of Pentacles, yeah. Three, there's three people on this card here. Yeah, this card shows someone, a man giving to two, someone giving to two. So I feel like, yeah, they're coming to balance things out with you here. They're leaving someone here and they're coming to work things out with you. come to balance things out this man's got the balance the scales in his hand six of pentacles balance and harmony 
they're leaving someone. This is someone that's in a situation with someone, but they're leaving that person, Queen of Cups, in reverse. Whoever they're leaving, they, they may have, it might be a Scorpio or a Cancer, Pisces, but yeah, Queen of Cups in reverse. Yeah, yeah. They're coming to talk to you, Queen of Swords. This is someone that wants to have a heart to heart conversation with you. We've got honestly discuss your feelings with each other. They, they want to open up here to you and have a heart to heart conversation. They're coming towards you. This is someone that is going to open up and honestly discuss their feelings that they have for you. I really feel like as hard and difficult as this situation is for this person to do, it's necessary because I feel like whatever situation they're attached to, yeah, it's not working out because this person's heart is not in that situation with that person. Their heart is with you here. As you can see, like the knight, this Knight of Cups is facing towards this situation here that they that they want to work out, that they want to bring balance in. They're bringing their cup towards this situation here. This is where their feelings are at. Their feelings haven't they haven't got feelings in that situation. There's no uh, love. It's a loveless situation that they are attached to, and the longer they stay in it the more heartbreak they cause in that situation. They're, they're unable to bring love in that situation and it's just causing heartache in that situation. I mean, the right thing to do would be to just set this person free, set themselves free, set this person free so that they can find the love that they deserve and this person is able to now, you know, pursue that the the love and happiness that they feel they deserve also it's the right thing to do it's hard but it's necessary because the longer this this situation carries on the more heartbreak everyone is suffering the more pain it's suffering because i can see this is someone that is hurt over the separation with you This separation with you, yeah, is painful. It is painful. They are hurt over it. And they can't get over it. It's, they can't get over it. And whoever they're with, they're attached to, is not helping either. Whoever they're attached to is not enough to make this person, you know, get over you. This person's still hurt. Whoever they're attached to, it's just not enough for them to get over you. They can't get over you. They're still hurt over the separation with you. And that hurt is actually spilling over into the situation they got with somebody else here and causing more heartache, you know, because only hurt people hurt people, you know. So this, this is someone that's hurt and they are hurting other people here because they're hurt. Because of the separation with you. Oh, so the best thing to do is to just, you know, break free from, you know, break free. It's toxic. It's unhealthy. It's time to detach, you know. Just do the right thing. I feel like this is the right thing this person is doing. Because they're only causing more heartache here. With other people. And it's just going to just spill over into other relationships, other friendships, family and life, you know. When you go through this kind of emotional pain, this emotional hardship, it can tend to affect other areas of your life. You might even affect, you might be even affecting this person's financial life as well. Ace of Pentacles in reverse. It might even be affecting their financial circumstances and everything. But um, this is why it's time to do the right thing here. Because I really feel like this person, 
they feel like they missed an opportunity with, uh, an opportunity with you like they see a major opportunity with you to be happy you know to be abundant here yeah this is someone that's always had love for you they've always loved you this separation from you it is killing them cuz they still love you <laughs> They love you even more. It is absolutely killing them. They feel like they missed the opportunity with you. They've made poor choices in the past, clearly. They made a poor choice. Yeah. For some of you, this person tried to keep you in this third party situation. They wanted to have their cake and eat it. But it looks like, you know, you put your foot down. <laughs> You're not having that, you know. Queen of Swords, so you cut this person out. You d you detached yourself from this third party situation. You cut this person out. And, uh, yeah, it brought on the pain. This person felt so betrayed, backstabbed, you know, hurt. Oh, my gosh. And they're, they're, they're still not over it. They can't, they can't continue without you. It's their, their whole situation is just messed up now because whoever they're with is hurt as well because this person's hurt because of you because you're not in their life. The thing is, this person knows that you're not going to be back in their life either if they are still, you know, attached to a third party situation. They've got to make a choice. Is one or the other. This person tried to have both, but they realise they have to make a choice. It's one or the other. Looks like they made this choice. Looks like they made their choice, you guys. Yeah, they're following their heart. They're choosing to follow their heart. And they're coming towards you. Coming towards you here and setting the other person free. Oh, it's the right thing to do. Let's get some more insight from the Love Oracle deck for this reading. Uh, so we've got Ascending, Transcending Obstacles. Okay. Yeah, we've got Axe, Breakup, Separation, Stop the Pattern. Yeah, I'm telling you. We've got snake, competition, enemy, clever, oh, okay, coffin, endings, bring new beginnings, yeah, seduction, attraction, flirting, and healthy choices in life and in love, wow, this is what is going on, yeah, so like I said, yeah, this person is a uh, Overcoming the obstacles here, they're, learn they're learning, they're expanding, and they're, they're heading into a new phase. They're preparing for union with you here. So they're trans transcending obstacles here. Letting go of what they need to let go of. Overcoming the obstacles. Yeah, so if that means they've got to end a situation with someone else and put an end to it, stop the pattern of hurting people here. Then so be it. This is what they got to do. It's a difficult choice, but sometimes you have to make sacrifices, you know, for, you know, for the things you love. For the life you love, yeah. So, like I said, yeah, that's come to, that situation's come to an end. Whoever they were with has come to an end. Endings bring new beginnings. It's time for growth, change, liberation, transition, yeah. Yes, yeah, it's a transition going on here. The other woman, competition, clever, look over your shoulder, malicious, the other woman. Yeah, you guys, I mean, yeah, definitely, you are the other woman in this situation. <laughs> or you might be the, oh gosh, oh sorry, you might be the one that this person's leaving, take it how it resonates, but yeah, I mean, it's all for the higher good of everybody in this situation, I feel. It's all about healthy choices. 
So yeah, we also got seduction as well. So this situation is definitely to be continued. So I'll see you soon. Mm-hmm. <laughs>